Hello everybody, I'm your brother Nine, and welcome back to Paper Mario 64. In the last episode, we... we solved the mystery, not the penguin murder mystery, we solved the mystery of the scarf and the bucket and the shrine, and we headed up towards the Crystal Palace, heading up Shiver Mountain. We also checked out everyone in the, uh, what was it, Starborn Valley, checked out that whole place and what it had to offer for us and all sorts of great stuff. And we also upgraded the last party member that needed an upgrade, and that is Goombario. Look at this. We have completely upgraded all the members in our party. What a great thing. Everyone's so upgraded. Now we can use Goombario to go beat up some enemies. We can show off his new power. And in this episode, we're going to be doing that. And we're going to be heading up the, uh, up the valley as well. Also, there's some items just chilling here all over the place. Like, give me this shooting star, please. I can't carry any more items. Okay. Can I get rid of something? To... Should I... Should I... I should use another maple syrup. Sounds like a great idea. I've got plenty of room for maple syrups. Now, I will take this shooting star. Thank you very much. Ah! Hey! Hey! What? Okay, alright, hold up. I, I know I know this rhyme, this rhythm. We can put that in there, and we we could get we could get a snowman. But what's the point? All the enemies here are ice, and it's not even as strong as a shooting star. And the thunder rage is good too. Is that a thunder rage? Yeah, that is a thunder rage. It it's good, but it's not as good as a shooting star. And we don't have anything else to get rid of. Oh, I guess we could get rid of the pow block really if we wanted to. But I think I think we're okay. The pow block's fine. We don't need the thunder rage. We're already powerful enough. We'll just continue on. But yeah, you can see, like, what they try to do there. Also, ha! I saw you. You can't trick. Oh, wait, hold up. Which way should I go? Should I go? Should I go up? Let's go up first, actually. Oh, we're supposed to... There's a space where you can put something. Or we can not put something. We can come over this way. Ah, there's something over here. I know what this means. We've seen plenty of these before. We've played Legend of Zelda. We know how this goes. We know the rhyme of the reason. Yeah. All right, what's in here? Whoa! Yo! Whoa! What? What? <laughs> I did. I did not remember that that was a thing that you could do. <laughs> Whoops! At last, it is Mario. I'm glad you found this place. I've been expecting you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ho ho! Do you find it strange that I know of you? My name is Madame Merlar. I'm a messenger of the stars. You know Merlon and Merle well. I am their ancestor. The stars spoke to me of you through my dreams. They, that's where it always is. They said you would come to the shrine on Shiver Mountain. It is here that I guard the way to the Crystal Palace. Are you dead? We have little time to- Alright, you are an ancestor, right? So you're still guarding. You may not know this, but the followers of Bowser have invaded Crystal Palace where stars are honored. Now, what I have to tell you is very important. Listen to every word I say. Oh no. I can't tell you the whole tale. In the interest of time, I'll be brief, so pay attention to the key points. Oh no. I know what's gonna happen. The story begins a long, long time ago, in a galaxy far away. I was still a young woman back then. A horrible thing happened on the mountain one day. I ran there immediately and... But it was actually... Oh, such a sight. I... Was... And... It was so... It was none other so than than I. And we've fallen asleep. Wonderful story, really. Beautiful. All sorts of great things that you're telling me about. So that's why you must get Bowser's men out of the Crystal Palace. But, hey, you! Were you even listening to my story? Yep, yep. We were definitely listening, for sure. Well, okay then. As I was saying, you need the Star Stone to reach the palace. I'll give it to you. Oh, baby! The Star Stone! With this stone, you can open the way to the Crystal Palace. Go on, make haste! Hmm. Do you think you understood my shortened version of the tale? Yes. It really doesn't do the story justice, you know. Perhaps one day I'll tell you the full story. Until then, good luck. I think you got your point across. Just fine. You did all sorts of great job in doing that, and I appreciate it. Also, I'm still- I totally forgot that this was what you were supposed to do at this point. I was just like, huh, 
I wonder what I can do. Like, there's nothing over here. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> so, I was very shocked. Though, I really do like this area. It's super pretty, and it's got all sorts of iceness, and it's just... It's just great. That that little cavern is fantastic, and I definitely appreciate it in all of its glory. But now we can put the star stone in here, and we can have it go into the into the wall. And raise some ice. That is also raising some stairs. Nice. Hey, proof. Nice. Hey, proof. Oh yeah, you know that's how it goes. All the way up there. Well, it's time to climb! And that's 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 a lot of A button presses. What's over here? There's a club over here! Whoop! Got right past you, clubba. Because I don't want to fight you. I just want my... Ha <laughs> My mega jump badge! Also, look at Bombette in the air. Mario stomps on a single enemy using tons of attack power. Alright, Clubba, thank you very much. I also don't remember what I was saying before I got into that fight, but that's okay. Also, there's there's a there's a thing right there. Can you see that? I can definitely see that. What's that nonsense about? I do not approve. Oh man, look at all the climbing that we had to do. And look, there's a save block here. Great, cool. However, you also notice this weird ending right here that's like, why is this like this? Well, you can fall down, and you can get a star piece! Yay! Now we have to we have to climb all the way back up. At least we can see Cooper's ridiculous animation as he climbs because his jump animation is fun. Also, Cooper, you're getting, you're kind of lagging behind. I was trying to show off your your fun lag animation and okay, thanks, Cooper. I appreciate that. Yo, heart block. Cool. I was just hoping for a heart block. Nice. Look at that. We're back 40. There's Cooper. Look at him. Hey. And there's a mirror in the background, nice. And we've now arrived at the Crystal Palace. Look at this mirror, it's so, it's so glistening and beautiful. Also, are there mountains on this side of us too? Like this way, because we can see mountains there, so. I wonder, I wonder. Cool, all right, cool. We'll just, we'll just head, hey, cool, all right, cool. That was great words. There's more mirror. We're just gonna have the mirror the entire way through this. Oh, I see how this, this is gonna work. Oh, we've got, we've got a key here. And we've got this nonsense. Do I need to? Yes, I do need to. Ah ha! I'm gonna move this down. And we've got another door. We've got a red door and a blue door. And we've got a switch. Ah, so when you press it, it switches to the other one. It switches to the other one. Cool. Alright, so I guess our only way to go is this way. There's a save block right there. There's there's a, literally a save block just the other side. Okay, cool. There's an X right here. Alright. That's fine. Also, I have. Oh, look, a new enemy. Cool. All right. I guess I, I'll forget what I was about to say until after this battle, because right now we've got a new enemy. All oh, right. They're they're on the ceiling, so you can't do anything. And Goombario can't do anything. We still haven't seen Goombario's new moves. That's that's a shame because he's got multi bonk, and we need to see that multi bonk. Swoopula. This is a Swoopula. Swoopula's attack from the air and cling to you to suck your HP. Max HP is eight. Attack power is two. Defense power zero. Hit A repeatedly to fight it off, or else it'll keep sucking your HP. You can't jump high enough to attack them while they're hanging from the ceiling. An earthquake attack ought to work, though. Flying party members like Bo or Park Harry can also attack them with ease. If they fall and begin to flap around, you can attack them by jumping as well. Alright. We, we fought some of these bros before. We know how to do the rhyme and reason. Also, oh, how should I go about this? Should, <laughs> should I use a POW block? Yo, let's use a POW block, because we can hit them with it. Might as well get them all off of the ceiling. Yeah! Oh, now we gotta press A repeatedly. I totally forgot that's what we're supposed to do. Also, wait, shouldn't... Do not Do I have Zap Tap off? Oh, I totally need to change that. Zap Tap needs to come back on, because I'm pretty sure these enemies can't even hurt you if you've got Zap Tap on. But we can, we can see that we got lucky. Cool. And I will now come in, and I'll attack you. Do all sorts of damage. And it's time! It's time for the multi bounk Press A right before hitting it. Several times in a row. I messed it up. That's okay. We still got we still got all sorts of damage on him. Also all oh, right, they suck our HP out and they get back. I was wondering why some of them were having like different different healths and everything. I was like, wait, didn't I do more damage to you than I thought? And this is this is the reason. I now understand. Okay, well, I see how it is. 
we will do another multi-bonk. That sounds like a great idea. And maybe I'll get more than two hits, I think it was. Yeah, uh, I definitely pressed it at the right time. Maybe you can only get a total of three hits. That might be the case. Wait, no, you totally gotta be able to get more than three hits, right? Right? Because that would only be six damage, and like six damage is what he does with the regular monk. Did I just, am I just messing it up? I'm probably just messing it up. Or maybe you have to link it with charge. I honestly don't know. I don't use Gumbario. Who uses Gumbario? Why would you ever use Gumbario? I'm sure he's actually great with his multi bong but I just, I just never use him. And it, it's very clear. Also, badges. Let's check my badges, because my badges do not seem to be what they should be. I don't have ZapTap on. That is a shame. ZapTap should be on, definitely. Alright, what are we going to get rid of to put that on? Um... Oh, let's get rid of Spin Attack. We don't need Spin Attack in this area. Why do you ever need Spin Attack in this area? Is that enough for ZapTap? I don't know. No, ZapTap needs one more. So, power jump? Maybe Super Jump Charge? Speed Spin? No, we definitely... Oh, we don't need Dizzy Attack. Yeah, there we go. We'll keep, we'll keep those on, and maybe I can find another one that I should put up. Is there any other ones that I can have? Power Smash. Double Dip? I could put Double Dip on. Uh, I don't see why I wouldn't. There's nothing else. What do we got? Mega Rush? Mars and Peril's attack power goes up by four. Oh, Mega Rush is actually really good. When Mars in danger, he receives only half damage. Oh, Last Stand. Actually, I want Last Stand instead of Double Dip. Or, actually, you know, instead of Last Stand, Power Rush. I just keep switching all the ones that I'm going to be using. That's alright, that's alright. We'll get rid of Double Dip. I don't need Double Dip too much. And then we can put Zap Tap on. And now I think I'm fine with all of my... Yeah, now we're good. We'll have any... These guys can't be doing anything to us. Ah, that's much better. We don't even have to worry about those enemies at all. We can just spend our turns using focus, getting our star power back up. What a great thing. Also, hey, what's this? We got the blue key! Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We got the blue key. Now we can definitely do some stuff over over here in the in the room with the, the, the big doors that do stuff. Nice. I approve. Also, that was a great way of saying things. What I mean to say is, in here, we're like, hey, Blue Key, now we can go this way. Yay! There we go. And and in here we have, we have, nice. We have something that we can do with Bombette. We can blow this up. Cool. It didn't blow up in the background. What? Um, hello, Mir? Interesting. It's not blown up on that side either. Huh. And the block isn't... What? What is going on? Huh. Can we... We can! It turns out it was a window, not a mirror, all along! Oh man, what does that mean for us? Well, it's coming here. Or what... Wait, so was it... If that was a... You! Yikes! Mario's here! Whoa, we better beat him! It's a Dupla Ghost! It's two Dupla Ghosts! Or is it gonna be four? No, it's two Dupla Ghosts! The reason that I'm still talking in this fight and not uh, cutting out of it is because I'm hoping that these guys decide to... Um... Decide to... Dupla... Dupla... Whatever... Duplicate... Duplicate... Bombat here, because we haven't tattled a Bombat question mark, question mark, question mark at all yet, and that would be a great idea. Yes! Yes! There we go! Now, now we can switch over to, um, Goombario. Yeah! We can get a nice tattle in on Bombette. It's a duple ghost disguised as Bombette. Max HP is 15. This disguise is pretty much perfect. Attack power is exactly the same as Bombette's. We should be careful even though she looks cute. <laughs> She does look cute, and I'll, I'll be very careful, thank you, appreciate that. And we're also going to switch you to be Cooper. And just, just in case the other one wants to, you know, like, do some duplicating of his own, I very much appreciate that, Mr. Dupl Ghost. Or you can do that, and you can hurt yourself, that's fine too. You know, just, just keep doing... Oh, you came in for the... Oh, no! Oh, poor thing. 
All right, you know what? I'm gonna try doing nothing because I want this guy to do so. If he's gonna, if he's going to die, it's gonna be of his own accord because I want to tattle. I want to tattle a new Cooper. Nope. All right, he's dying of his own accord. I'm sorry, bro. Like I gave you the opportunity to live, and you just decided to not do that. It's your own fault. No, the real Mario is so strong. Why, thank you. I appreciate the compliment. I am very strong. Also, look at this, look at this nonsense. We are in the background. And there, there's all sorts of things. Can I even move the door? I can! I can move the door! Oh man! We need to find ourselves a red key. Or or do we? Or do we? Yeah, okay, we still need to find ourselves a red key. We could probably find it in that door right there. But instead of doing so, I'm gonna come over this way. I'm gonna come out of the castle, or palace, come back here, and what? Where does this lead? It leads to a star piece! Yeah, I knew it! I knew it! Alright, well, that's cool, that's fun, that's interesting. I actually, I really like the Crystal Palace. Not only is the music here just, like, superb, and one of my favorite songs in the entire game, but I really like this dynamic of them, uh, duplicating the rooms on on both sides so like you kind of see like all these different things like like I think on the other side this was a um, this was a save block and on this side it's there was a or on the other side there was a red X and now we've got this here so I don't know I think it's cool I think they do a great job in this in the palace it's it's one of my favorite things in this game also I'm gonna get this enemy eventually don't worry there we go Oh, hey, so during this fight, we had a duple ghost that decided to transform into Cooper, and now we are going to Cooper Cooper question mark. It's a duple ghost disguised as Cooper, Max HP 15. This imposter almost looks better than the original. Ha! Wow, this disguise is pretty much perfect. His attack power is exactly the same as the character it's imitating. Probably not very difficult for this duple ghost to disguise himself as Cooper. After all, our pal is pretty unusual looking. It's probably not very difficult for him to disguise itself. I feel like it would be more difficult if he's pretty unusual looking, but okay. It'll attack us with its shell, just like the regular Cooper. You have the best luck beating if you if you flip it. Yeah, we can we can flip it. And I think we will do so. Oh, he's he's doing a regular attack. Alright, cool. I thought he was gonna go in for like a flaming shell or something. But that's alright. What we're gonna do is we're going to we're gonna flip him right over <laughs> with our newfound uh, three damage, which I didn't even, I didn't even get the action command, so that was fantastic. But that's okay, because he wasn't going to do anything to us either way. So now we have three party members of Duplicos have been, um, tattled, which is great and fantastic. And now we can go down here as well. But I think I'll go this way first, possibly. Would that be a better way to go? There's a Duplicos there. I would do so. Oh, baby, and in this fight we had a par carry. Duple Ghost? It's a Duple Ghost disguised Par Carry, Max HP is 15. He looks even more intelligent as an enemy. This disguise is pretty much perfect. His attack power is exactly the same as Par Carry's. Don't underestimate him, Mario. He looks pretty serious. He's also got defense, which he doesn't mention. And, oh man, he did a bunch of damage. Oh, he also got taken out of his... Alright, I'm fine with that. We are low. We are very low. Is that because he got zap tapped? Is that why he got taken out of his uh, disguise? That's weird. Also, yo, look at that. More star points. We've got 10 star points, and I could probably use a smooch in the next battle. I'll probably do that, because we're we've got 15 away from the next level, so like there's there's plenty of opportunities for me to do so. And it's almost gonna be guaranteed coming up very soon, so we'll be good. Hey! We got a shooting star instead of a what do we get on the other side? Oh, we got the, the blue key. So we didn't get the red key this time. That's a little unfortunate. But that's okay, because we can go down here. We've still got a second way to go. And there's a nice spring down there, too. Cool. I approve. And there's Swoopulas. Alright, cool. I'll fight you. Thank you, Swoopulas. I really appreciate that. Also, we are very close to our next level. Oh, there's another Swoopula here. Let me guess. Oh, man. It is just barely not enough. We've got two more star points until we get to the next level. We're so close! Oh, that's a little, a little frustrating, but it's okay. We got the P down D up edge. We did not get the red key. We got a new badge, which P down that puts our power down and our defense up. Interesting. Okay, well, 
we have to go find the... Did I say red badge? No. All right, we got to go find the red key. However, I think we will do that in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please click that like button. Remember, you can always click subscribe if you want to stay updated on this series and other stuff coming out from me. I hope I will see you in the next episode. We will continue through the Crystal Palace, hopefully get through almost all, if not all of it, um, in the next episode. So that'll, that'll be fun. And I hope you are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching.